Hey everyone, so sliding, not so cool. Um, yeah, it's not that cool. I don't like the lighting right now. Um, anywho, um, so this past week I was supposed to have finished cleaning, um, painting the room, but I didn't, as you can tell, you know, same colors. Um, instead of painting, we decided to look for the headboard and extra accessories for my room and pretty much what we did is we just went to thrift shops in our area um, and we found that headboard it only cost a dollar and ninety eight cents which is pretty cool it's a little bigger than what I needed it but my dad's gonna help me like cut it down all that good stuff and I have some more things I'm gonna show you guys um, of course, most of the stuff that I got, I'm going to have to be painting it so that it'll match my new room. This is not my new room, like I said, um, but for when my new room is ready so that it matches my new room, I guess. Um, and I'm pretty excited. So, I have a couple things that I'm going to show you guys. So, number one is that cool headboard. Um, pretty much the theme that I was going for is like a vintage kind of feel. Um... And I'm pretty sure you guys have all seen my bedspread. This is what my pillows look like. Pretty much it's just this really pretty vintage like print. And then these little things. I've never liked those since day one, but oh well. And then you can flip it over and it's a white version. So it has a black version and a white version. So, well, pretty much the, the comforter um, is pretty much the same thing. It's black on one side, white on the other side. And all this time with my, you know, white and pink walls, I've had the black side up. But when I change it to the taupe color that I was that I'm talking to you guys about, which I have no idea where the little paper is. I think it's somewhere over there. But anyways, um, once I painted that color, the room is gonna be a lot darker. Um, but it's it's like a taupe color. Um, so a lot of the stuff that I have are going to be painted um so like my desk is going to be painted white because you know I kind of just didn't think that the black contrast is going to be so nice um those little cubbies are going to stay the same but um my nightstand which you guys are on top of um is going to get painted because I don't know if you guys have seen my previous video one of my previous videos I show my nightstand and it's all kind of scratched up um, because I haven't had the time to paint it, um, and this was in mine, um, someone left it in one of my mom's apartments, and I thought it was really pretty, and it has pretty much the curvature of it, it is very similar to the headboard, which I was like, oh, that's so cool, um, which I noticed earlier today, um, and so pretty much it's kind of scratched up, so the only thing I'm going to do to that is pretty much paint it white. Um, of course sanded and all that good stuff. The bad thing with that desk is that we never sanded it. So I think it was like yesterday yesterday or the day before that. For some reason I saw something hanging down from the top of my desk. And I was like, well, what is that? And I pull it and I pull off like this big chunk of paint. I was like, oops, I probably shouldn't have pulled that. But that desk, of course, we'd never sand because uh, we never did sand. Because um, we painted it when we were switching rooms. Because it's a long story. We lived here. We switched rooms like three or four times. Me and my sister. And then we moved. And then we moved back here. And then we switched rooms again. So it's a long, long story. But anyways. So that needs to get sanded. Um, a lot of the stuff I have I need to get sanded and painted. Which, you know, it's pretty obvious. Because I haven't painted any of these things in so long. Or like this nightstand has never been painted. Um, my desk has been painted, but badly painted because it's like a mess. So yeah. So now I'm going to show you guys some more things that I got from um, the thrift store. Pretty much it's just three frames and this little organization thing for my desk. And then I guess I'll just talk after that. But I just want to get this like mini haul over with. Um, so yeah, pretty much 
um, we found these frames, which were really pretty, and we were not going to leave this picture. I'm going to change the picture. What I kind of planned to put on the wall were, like, black and white pictures of stuff, because I just think it would look a lot cooler with, you know, black and white bedspread. And then I have something black and white on the walls, um, especially on this wall, because, as you can see, that's one big wall that has nothing on it. And my bed is going to be where my desk is, but it's going to be sticking out this way. Um, so, yeah, it's a pretty big difference. Um, but this, where my bed is now, was where my old bed was. Um, so pretty much I'm going to be keeping this bed, except for painting it. Because it's this really ugly wood color, if you guys can see, like, over there. It's, like, a really ugly wood color that I don't like. Um, but anyways... So, pretty much the layout is going to be completely different. My bed's going to be over here. Um, my big makeup thing. Not that thing. My big makeup thing. Well, it's so hard to point with webcam. This makeup thing and this dresser thing behind me is all going to be on this wall. My bed is going to be on this wall. My desk is going to be on this wall. So, I'm, t I'm telling you, it's going to be like a totally different room. Um, so, yeah. This is one of the frames that we got. And it has a really pretty detail in surprised my camera's picking it up this good but it looks like that and I kind of like the color but I'm not sure if I want to leave it this color I, I kind of wanted to see because you know it's going to be on this taupe colored walls and I'm thinking this might be too dark for that so I'm thinking maybe you know a white frame would look nicer especially since the only thing that's going to be white is going to be all like the doors the trimming around the windows and all that good stuff. <laughs> so I got two of these. They had a lot of them because they all say like rose is for the month of June and then like a daffodil is for the month of March. So I'm guessing they had like 12 of them there. <laughs> I don't know. But they look like this and so I'm going to put black and white pictures in here. Um, and they only cost $2.98 and the day we went um, all the blue tags were like certain percent off so they were a little bit cheaper than what they are well than the 298 is that what you think? Yeah, than 298. And so then I got this bigger frame whew, that I kind of planned. I was gonna tell my sister she draws a lot and she it paints a lot as well. So I was gonna ask her to like paint me an original with like random words, like just pretty much inspiring words that I like on like something big like this not sure I'm still gonna do that I'm kind of aww yeah but why else would I close my door I don't know that's why I was wondering why she closed her door she didn't say okay fine. no go <laughs> go oh, what are you doing just dropping off your paper for this year for school for school oh yeah and <laughs> and then um so I'm not sure if I want to put words on this frame or like make one random huge collage of like family pictures in here. I don't know. But this one was only $4.98 and again it was on sale. Because they had they had like certain days, certain colored items, certain price colored price tags are like marked off. So and then I found this really cool thing. It looks like this. You know, it holds picture, um, papers here. And then it has these little organizing cubbies, I guess. And I thought it was really cute. The only thing I didn't like was, like, the color of this wood. Um, so I'm kind of going to be painting the wood part. I'm not sure if I'm going to be painting, like, I think I'll just paint all of it one color. So if it's all going to be black, I'll just spray paint it all black. Um, whatever. I think I'll probably paint it black though since it's going to be going on my desk and my desk is going to be white. So if I paint it white, it's going to look too white, you know? I don't know, I'm confusing myself. So then that was this. And then underneath my... Should I just get it down? Yeah, I'll put you guys on top of this. Okay. Quick change here. Yeah. I'll show you guys what that's for. Isn't it like usually for like kitchen stuff? Okay. Oh, you guys might be too high now. Oh, well. And then we bought this weird thing. I have no idea what it is. 
This one costs $1.98 as well. Um, what we're going to do with it is we're going to be putting it on my wall. Because if you guys haven't noticed, I have like my earrings right there. Sorry, it's like behind my headboard. Then I have all my necklaces up there on the door. Um, and all my bangles. This is the only part I hate is that my like most of my jewelry is over there. In there I have like um, squishy bracelets and stuff like that. Not squishy. But the ones that have no form, I guess. And then I have, like, my favorite jewelry in that little one. And then I have, like, little stud earrings in that little tiny box right there. And then I have all, like, my dangly earrings on this one. And then all my necklaces are on the door. Well, behind the door. And then over here, you have to, like, walk all the way over here to this right, wait, right there. And those, in the top one, is where all my, like, stiff, whoa, all my stiff bangles are. And pretty much, I that's like kind of weird because I have to go like over here, find bangle, over there, find earrings, and then over there, you know, it's kind of too much. Of like, you have to go all the way across the room to get a bangle. So, pretty much, what I wanted to do is me and my mom came up with the idea. Um, but what we're gonna do is we're going to have my dad cut some of these, and then he's going to pull two out like this. So pretty much they're going to be sticking out this way. And the bangles are going to be put like this. So you can see them all, like say from this angle, you can see them all. And then um, it's going to be hanged up like from these top corners. And he's going to cut off this back part. So that was our idea. <laughs> um, but it's going to be like two and then... Okay, so this one will be for bangles. This row will just be cut off. This one will be for bangles, this row will be cut off, this row will be for bangles, and then, of course, you know. Anyways, so that was our idea. Let's hope it works out because um, we were trying to think about where I could put the bangles and stuff, and she really didn't want to buy, like, an actual bangle holder, like, say, from, like, online or stuff. So we just came up with that idea. I'll tell you guys if it really does come out right. Anyways, my mom's the one that came up with the idea to hook my all my necklaces and stuff on the door so yeah it was pretty cool so I think that's all pretty much from my room stuff except for of course there is stuff like new things that are in here like of course my guitar is like right there and funny thing was that when my sister brought it um my the bed wasn't here and she put it against this wall and it was like literally the same color I'm so surprised. But, yeah. So, that's all for today. Um, I don't know what other kind of videos you guys want to see. I guess I will today I will definitely be doing a nail polish of the day. Well, this this has actually been a nail polish of the week, though. Because I think I'm kind of sure it's almost going to be a week. And pretty much it's amazing. So, I'll talk to you all later. Bye. Oh, gosh, this thing is shaking. I don't want my computer phone. Okay, bye.